Hey plant fam, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Jacqueline. This is not my jungle, it's my car because we're in the car at Home Depot. Because we're going to go to Home Depot. We're at Home Depot. Oh my god, what is wrong with my brain? It's been a while since I've been here. I rolled myself out of bed. So I look like this because I literally just rolled myself out of bed and came here. And we're going to go see what they have. The last time I was here, all they had was pothos and more pothos and more pothos, which is fine. We love pothos, right? But we don't need more of it. So hopefully they have something new and different and I'm gonna show you around anyway. It's been a while since we did a good old fashioned Home Depot tour. So I hope that you enjoy it. If you do, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. I just hit the ceiling. It's fine. People are staring at me. It's good. It's good. Notification bell so you don't miss this awkward crap. Anyway, let's go inside because this lady is like really staring at me hard. Ah, I came at just the right time. All the new plants. Wait for them to finish putting them out. I see cute things. I see cute things. Yes, sir. Cute. We have a couple. He's not as happy. I'm gonna pick the best. I'm gonna check out all the cute little cacti. I don't know if you guys can actually even hear me because there's so much going on in here right now. But I'm just checking out the cacti and succulents because they're actually putting out new plants as we speak. And I'm probably gonna take home this Hoya Lacunosa oil flesh. I'll probably break it into smaller pieces because I don't actually want this whole entire full plant, but I just want a baby one. But I can share it with you guys. I <laughs> just want a little bit of it. So I'm just waiting for them to finish putting all the plants out. Okay, so we've got some golden pothos hanging here for $16.95. Some pretty full baskets. Some neon pothos for the same price. And then down here we have this really cute calla lily. Why are they so cute? Look at it, it's purple. And then this golden pothos for $14.98 on a moss pole. It's not a bad price. Some anthurium. I think these are bird's nest ferns for $14.98. Here you've got your fancy croton. I don't know what it is that makes it fancy, but apparently it's fancy. 
Ooh, she fancy. For $26. And then this little pothos for $12.98, which is overpriced, in my opinion, for Home Depot. For this little pothos. And then we have a cute Bird of Paradise here for $29.98. Adorable. This Sago Palm for $14.98. Looking pretty happy. Diefenbachia for $14.98. They just put them out, so super happy. Some Dracaena, more Pothos. And then they have these hanging Maranta plants, Red Maranta, for $16.98. This is probably one of my favorite in this variety, but I can't keep these alive to save my life, so <laughs> we just don't do those. And over here, we have some giant alocasia. I don't know what that other one is. The alocasia is $26.98, and apparently it's also fancy. I don't know what makes it fancy, again, but it's fancy. And then we have an umbrella tree for $26.98, and this Diefenbachia over here for the same price. Okay, so over here we have this really cute lipstick plant that I also kind of wanted to buy, but I don't have room for. It's called a Twister Lipstick Plant. A Scenanthus Radicans for $16.98. The leaves were kind of like soft. I don't really know how to explain it, but it was really cute. And if I had room for it, I probably would have bought that one as well as the Hoya. And we have some Croton over here because it's fall and they just do that for some reason because of the colors. Some Peperomia, more Pothos. I think this is a Stromanthe that we're looking at here with the maroon undersides. Some Peace Lilies, Sansevieria. They also had this Trio Star Stromanthe, which I don't usually see in Home Depot. It's super cute. $29.98. The fancy Sansevieria for $26.98. I think the fancy just means that it's in a pot and not just in a nursery container, but I still think it's really funny that they call it fancy. So fancy. And over here we've got some hanging Rex Begonia for $16.98. Looking a little sad, maybe, from shipping, but otherwise cute. I'm not into it. I don't like the Rex Begonia that much. I like the Angel Wing Begonias, though. They're cute. And then I think this is a Pylea. I don't know what kind, but they had a bunch of them. And of course, it's just labeled as beautiful home decor. It's very helpful, Costa Farms. Thank you. Appreciate it. <laughs> are you trying to get to this? That's all you got to do? Yes. So you're going to scan it for me? I'm going to scan it for you. You're the best. It's been a public service thing. I know. I love it. You make uh, my yes, day. So have a blessed day. Sir. Thank you, Paul. You too. Come on down. How was it like it was freezing a couple of days ago and now I'm like back to dying? What is this weather? All right, you guys, I uh, 
I um, I'm sweating to death. It's fine. It's it's good. It's good. We're good. We're good. So they had some cute stuff. I was kind of going back and forth between that lipstick plant and the Hoya, but I ended up getting the Hoya, as you would have seen already. This is a Hoya Lacunosa Royal Flush, and it was, ooh, $16.98, I think. Yeah, $16.98. It's not, it's not like, it's not sad, but it also doesn't seem happy. But I know that the Lacunosa's leaves are like supposed to be kind of soft. So I'm not 100% sure exactly what the deal is with this plant. If you know, if you have any care tips, help a sister out because I'm not going to actually keep this whole pot probably. I don't have room for it. The last time that I saw it here, there was only one basket left and it was really sad and I just, I wasn't about that life. So these leaves are really cool. I don't know if you could tell, you could see like the veining because they're kind of thin. I'm going to have to show you guys like a nice close up of the leaves because I feel like it doesn't really do it justice just by looking at it from here. But I got lucky. They were literally, as you would have seen, just there filling up all new plants. So they just, they just put this out. Picked the best one, obviously. I'm glad that I, I got here right when they did. So it was a little chaotic, so I couldn't talk. There were so many people there doing things. So I'm going to have to do a voiceover. So I apologize for voiceover, Jackie that you would have already heard. I'm like severely confused today. And I hope that you enjoyed Paul. I love him. He were, he's been working at this Home Depot for a really long time and he just is so happy all the time. He's always singing to everybody. So I tried to film a little bit of that in there so that you guys can get an idea of what my local Home Depot is like. And the people here are really nice, so. I'm gonna go. That is it for this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. Like I already said, give it a thumbs up, all that stuff. And yeah, I hope I see you in the next one. Not looking like a hot, sweaty mess. Put this air on. Ah, oh, that feels good. Nasty, that's disgusting. Nice. Send help. Okay, you guys, so we're back home, and I wanted to show you a close-up of this plant and how cute this, like, silvery variegation is on it. And I was hoping that you'd be able to see kind of, like, the veining and the texture better on these leaves when the sun kind of comes through them and hits them just right. They're really pretty, really, really cute, and I'm very happy very happy with this plant. Are you happy with this plant? He doesn't care. But I like it. <laughs>